The following segment is sponsored by Vision. For the eighth consecutive year, Utah has been ranked as the worst state in the nation for women's equality. According to Wallet Hub's annual report, this week 100 Utah companies will be honored by the governor's office for their efforts to address this critical issue. Joining us now to discuss Vasion's impactful work is Chief of People Officer Melissa. Welcome to the show, Melissa. Thank you, Carrie. It's great to be here. It's so good to see you. Okay, Vasion is being honored by the governor's office. What is Vasion? We are a company with a vision to make digital transformation attainable for everyone. We do that by creating software that has digital forms, signature, workflows to help orchestrate automation and make business processes easier. Okay, amazing. I love the name. Okay, and Silicon Slopes and the tech industry as a whole is male dominated. Why aren't more women in tech and how can we fix this problem, Melissa? Yeah, it's something that's been a problem for a while um, with trying to bring more young women up through STEM. Um, in Utah specifically, the culture and climate are changing. Um, families aren't as traditional as they used to be. The cost of living is increasing, which is bringing more women back to the workplace. Oh, that's a really good point. Okay, your company is one of 100 being honored by the governor on Thursday for championing women. What made a difference in seeing more women join Vision and stay at your company as well? I think there's a few things we've done. We've intentionally created space, not just in our roles and organization, but even in our physical environments. Actual we have, space. Yes, actual space. In the, in the office, we have a beautiful women's lounge where women can go unwind. We put a partition in the gym so they can exercise with more privacy. We also are looking to do supportive practices and policies. We've doubled our parental leave. In Utah, nothing is mandated, but we are really competitive in that arena. Okay, that's huge. That is really, really big. And this is great progress, but there's more work to be done. How can companies really work to increase female representation? There's always more to be done. Well, we're proud of the progress we've made. One thing I would say is to have guidelines for managers on how they can help women return to work. Um, in addition to that is really posting your roles and getting your uh, jobs out where women might see them so that we're encouraging them to apply for the jobs that we have really intentionally targeting and then the last thing is just changing the narrative I think mm -hmm. for some women they don't know what it's going to be like to come into work and we've done videos and things having our women speak about the experience they have at work so really having that narrative and encouraging them to apply oh those are such great ideas thank you for all the work you are doing where can we go for more information um, you can go to vision.com, which is our website, for our careers page or to ask for a demo. Okay, amazing. Melissa, great to see you. Thank you so much for all the work you're doing once again, and we appreciate it. As a female, I appreciate it too. Thanks Thank so much, you so Melissa. much. Great to see you. Good to be here.